A local climber who has been to the top of the world is reacting to a tragedy on Mount Everest. 11 climbers have died so far just this year, some of them after they reached the summit. As KEZI 9 News reporter Michael Severn shows us, that climber says more could be done to prevent the deaths. Michael. Yeah, China, Canberra Ward, who's made the trip, says climbers need to know their limits and when to turn back, but says less people on the mountain could make a world of difference. For Nepal, the tourism industry is a huge part of their economy, and so this is very important to them, but, but uh, you know, to what extreme? Canberra Ward knows Mount Everest better than most. In 2011, the Eugene resident made the journey to the mountain's base camp, 17 and a half thousand feet above sea level. She says the 11 deaths on the mountain this year alone are heartbreaking. You don't want anyone to die, whether they're climbers or Sherpas. Or According to ABC News, 2019 has been one of the deadliest seasons on record. They say some of the factors include a record number of permits to climb the mountain and a shorter window of good weather conditions and massive overcrowding. When we were there in 2011, just trekking to base camp, uh, the trail was pretty populated. There were a lot of climbers, a lot of trekkers. Ward and other experts say a lack of experience may also be playing a factor into the deadly season. While she made the journey to the base camp, she tells me she never wanted to take the risk to go to the summit and is urging other climbers to know their limits. I know what my limitations are, and, um, and I have a lot of respect for every mountain. If I'm going to go somewhere, and experience it, I want to come home. Coming up at 6, I'll show you the training that Ward did to prepare for her trip and the challenges she faced. Live in studio, I'm Michael Severin, KEZI 9 News.